Extinction Rebellion is known for its congestion-causing protests. Today was no different. Morning traffic in the CBD halted as demonstrators cycled slowly along main roads. Ending with a die-in at King George Square. It's all part of the group's ongoing protests against government inaction on climate change, and they aren't apologising for the delays. The inconvenience of being stuck in traffic is nothing compared to mass extinction, mass starvation, social collapse. That is the reality we're looking at with the climate crisis that's emerging. In an interview on 2GB, Home Affairs Minister Peter Dutton called for the mandatory sentencing and removal of welfare payments for the traffic blocking protesters. Meanwhile, Queensland police say they have tried to communicate with the group. Our experience with this particular group of folk is that they generally don't engage with us. Uh, and um, it's actually very difficult for us to help them uh, facilitate lawful protest. The group will begin their week of rebellion next week with protests planned every day. Police understand people will be frustrated but urge the public to remain calm with universities and schools back next week. Lawrence Jeffcoat, QUT News.